What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at these bellows right here and you can see from this sometimes the, the water as it doesn't evaporate it builds up this this lovely yuck right yuck nobody wants to deal with this. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be using a product here called Zep Mold Stain and Mildew Stain Remover. We're going to go ahead so I've got this stuff here in a bottle regular bottle here filled up I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna spray the inside of the bellows let it sit come back check it out and see if uh, that doesn't solve our stain problem so since the product is running a lot I'm gonna take some paper towels what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna fold them and tuck them inside the bellows what this should hopefully do for us is saturate the towel so that the product stays in place and that it helps with the process of uh, soaking and removing that mildew. Okay, so we're gonna let that sit and we're gonna come back, see the results. Okay, so I let the uh, bleach sit in here, that, that Zep product, I let it sit in here for about two days with the paper towel. Now, some of it is gone, but there's still, there's still more work to be done. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna take, uh, I'm gonna take some Clorox, I'm gonna pour it in and wash the machine uh, with some Clorox and see if that can help get rid of the rest of the mold. So this is what it looks like after the wash. The key point is for it to never get like this, but it's often hard. You're washing, you forget, you gotta, no one wants to have to wipe out this, uh, this gasket every single time after you wash. So just gotta figure out the best product and best means to, to get it going. All right, so here's this product we're gonna try out here. It's the Active Washing Machine Cleaner. Uh, the last method we tried didn't work out, so we're gonna give this a shot. It cleans, deodorizes, refreshes, and protects. So let's go ahead, pop this in the machine, and see what the results will be. Okay, so the cycle has completed. Let's see what we got here. Well, it's a deep cleaner, but not deep enough. Okay, so here is the machine as it stands after the use of the tablet. All right, so we picked up this product off of Amazon, Sugellery. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna put it on the bellows and see what it looks like after it sits overnight. All right, so here's the product. Comes with a little screw top. Screw that off. And then we're just going to go ahead and Squeeze some of this product out. And we're just gonna smudge that in place and kinda, kinda see what happens. So, just gonna spread that around all in the spots and we're gonna see what happens. So I basically um, put the product down and I use these gloves to spread it. I use these gloves to kinda smear it all around the areas that I want. You can notice a nice thick layer in here and we're gonna let that sit overnight we've got some hair in the grooves right where it needs to be right up in all of this right up in there we've got it all in the grooves so we're gonna let that sit overnight and uh, see what we get okie dokie so here's what we got here we have still some mold in here 
Um, I have noticed that leaving the dryer door open has definitely uh, helped tremendously. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and apply another application of this mold stain cleaner. Let it sit. The, um, the seller on Amazon said sometimes you do have to do more than more than one application so we're gonna go ahead and do that and see what we get so there we have yet again another nice thick layered application here we're gonna let that sit for about maybe 24 plus hours and see if it does the job ladies and gentlemen I am happy to announce that we do have a winner we have a winner it just takes depending on how bad your mold stain is it could take two, three applications, but we do have a winner and I can't wait to show you these amazing results. So, drum roll. And here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Here we have it. As you can see, the mold is absolutely gone. This product is amazing. I had no idea that it would take multiple applications, so I appreciate the seller of this product on Amazon reaching out to me to see if I got the desired results I needed. And here we have it. There is no more mold. So here are the things that you will need to maintain a clean washing machine. First up, we have the active washing machine cleaner. I think these work pretty good. Cleans, deodorizes, refreshes, and protects. Okay, I did use some of these in the process, but I would say in order to maintain a clean machine, you're gonna wanna use these periodically to keep your machine clean. Now, in the event that you do have really bad mold stains, you're gonna wanna go ahead and use this product right here. I will leave a link in the description for all the products that were used, but you're gonna wanna use this product here. Again, it may take multiple applications, but you will get those desired results. As I've seen here, you'll see in the before and the after shots how well this product has truly worked to get rid of the mold stain. And number three, after you are finished washing your clothes, I think it's a good practice to keep the door open. This will help for air to ventilate inside of this uh, cavity here. It will help to dry out this area here within the seal so that you will not have so much condensation buildup because when that door is closed, there's no air to help suck that moisture out. So good practice, leave the door cracked, Clean your machine regularly with the tablets and use this if you have any mold stains that need a really good treatment, use this product right here. It's your boy BT, thanks for checking out this video. I really hope this video is able to help someone out because this has been something that I have been uh, dealing with for quite some time trying to find a solution. So I'm glad that I found a solution that I can share with you guys. So thanks for checking out this video and I'll catch you guys on the next one.